Here's your NBC 26 News update. I'm Nina Sperano. The University of Wisconsin Green Bay has reinstated its indoor mask mandate for anyone who may be around other people. Brown County recently moved into a high rate of CDC transmission. The agency recommends people wear masks indoors in those areas. As the Delta variant of the COVID-19 is leading to an increase of positive cases in northeast and central Wisconsin, ThetaCare is adding additional testing sites and dates to ensure access to testing. They'll be offering free testing at UW Oshkosh, the Fox City Stadium, and in Nina Menasha in the coming weeks. And Packers News Family Night returns tomorrow, and the Packers want to help people looking to get vaccinated against the virus. Brown County Mobile Vaccination Unit will be parked on the east side of the stadium with Bell and Health administering COVID-19 vaccines and providing information for those who want to learn more. You can watch the annual Family Night practice on WACY My32. Coverage begins at 7 o'clock with practice beginning at about 7.30. Time now for a check on our forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Nina, temperatures this Friday running a little bit cooler, at least compared to what we've been seeing over the last several days. We now have upper 70s to lower 80s out there thanks to a lot of clouds and occasional showers and thunderstorms that are starting to pop up. Any showers and thunderstorms that do develop potentially could be on the strong to severe side. We'll see more of the same tomorrow. Lots of clouds, but even cooler. Highs mainly in the mid to upper 70s. Once again, any storms that pop up could be strong to severe with some locally heavy rain. For your latest news, sports, and weather, download the NBC26 News app. It's free. Just search for WGBA. Have a great weekend.